up guys, Jake here. Today I'm with my buddy Pioneer Polly. I'm actually in Canada today doing something I've always wanted to do since I was a young kid. Today we're going scuba diving for gold. Now I've never done this before but Pioneer Polly does this all the time and he shares all his adventures on YouTube so definitely check him out if you guys haven't yet. But today he's brought me in his backyard to go scuba diving for gold like I said. Before we get started let me show you guys the tools that we're going to use to hopefully find some good stuff down there. So to start things off I have what is called a gold sucker and I'll be honest with you guys I kind of named these myself. I don't know the correct terms of each device but I have a gold sucker. Anytime I find gold I'm actually going to suck it up into this thing and then at the very end of the video I'm gonna show you guys all the gold we find if I find gold that's too hard to get with this or my fingers I have some tweezers and I'll grab the gold with the tweezers I have a rock scraper anytime there's rocks in between other rocks I'll just scrape it out like this to get to down to the bedrock and I also have a crowbar so hopefully with these tools we can find my very first piece of gold and I'm excited to get out there and start scuba diving I just put up a drone in there to show you guys a bird's eye view of what this place looks like from the ground level it's absolutely stunning and we're in the middle of the woods here in Canada and I can't wait to start diving and looking for treasure and hopefully today we can find our first piece of gold I've got the scuba tank on my back, got the goggles, and all the tools we need to hopefully find some good stuff down there. With that said, let's go ahead and get underneath the water and get this started. So what I'm doing right now is I'm using this rock, I guess, scraper and scraping all the rocks and just moving all the stuff. And then when I see gold, it's like really shiny for me. I don't know how it's going to look on camera, but I'll, I'll be able to stop what I'm doing and grab it. Do my lips are frozen. <laughs> Justin out here helped me out filming the video today too. He's got the big camera so I can get beautiful shots. But Justin, you just saw me first hand find it. That's crazy, bro. Good work. Wow, dude. That's the first one of the day, I think. Yeah, you think, you think it's good or like, you think it's like, a, like crazy good or you think it's just good? good. I mean, that's a nugget. Yeah. Well, I think you'd call it a picker. Picker? Picker. Right, no, that's a boulder. <laughs> 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 that is so cool. Crazy, dude. Dude, this is a spot. It makes money. <laughs> I know. <laughs> My turn. <laughs> <laughs> 
，慢点，慢点。<笑>I just got out of the water. I want to give you guys a quick update. I found some gold. I haven't found a ton of gold, but my first piece of gold I found was a giant nugget, and I found some flakes right after that. But it's so much fun. I think Paulie calls it sniping for gold. So you have that little bottle, and you're just sniping and or picking up the gold from the bottom. And what I'm doing is just moving all these gravel and rocks from like the middle of the bedrock, and that's where you can find the heaviest uh, metals, which is the gold. And hopefully, I can get some more uh, some more gold down there, man. So that's us. Go ahead and gear up, dive down, and hopefully find some more gold. Fish touched my foot. <laughs> I'm freezing cold right now, but I've been sitting here at this like slab of rock and I'm finding gold after gold. Like they're pretty small, but the first one I found was the picker and I had to unscrew the top and put it in. But I found a bunch of little ones and this is a ton of fun, man. It's like the ultimate little spot, so I'm gonna keep at it. If I find any more stuff, I'll show you right here. Justin, look at this. Boom! Oh my Two goodness. pickers, dude. Did you just find that? Yeah. Just then? Yep. <laughs> Holy I was going like this, dude. I saw two of them and I freaked out. Like, that was awesome. I don't know how, like, rare these are, but from my finds today, I've only had a couple pickers, and these are two really good ones. That could be worth, like, what? 16 grand? 
No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I honestly have no idea how much that's worth, but that's pretty cool, dude. Two good sized pickers. This spot has so much gold. All right, so what I have to do is actually unscrew the top, put it in my gold second device. And like I've said before, that's like always a good feeling. Oh man, that's awesome. <laughs> I'm having so much fun, dude. I gotta definitely Epic. do this again in the future. All right, we're getting back down there. Wish me luck. I want to find one where like I need your help bringing it up. <laughs> oh, that'd be epic. <laughs> that would be epic. <laughs> All right, guys. So Paulie's in the water scuba diving. He just pulled me over here, and he said he wants to jump off this cliff over here. It's pretty high, but I think we're gonna go for it. Yeah, that was awesome. Yeah. We're gonna weigh the gold I found to see actually how much it weighs and potentially how much it's worth. 4.39, so 4.4 grams of gold. It's about $230 right now as per the weight, but the fact that you have nuggets, you can sell those to a jeweler for a premium, and these have actual character to them, so I think you can easily sell those for more. Heading out of this jungle right now, we got Mr. Paulie behind me here. Had a great time. Thank you, Paul, for taking me out, man. No if you guys want to check out some of his videos, or if you want to check out more gold hunting videos, I'll have a link to his videos in the description below. Check them out. Tell them Jake sent you. But, Paulie, thank you so much for taking me out today, man. I really do appreciate it. No everything. worries. We found some gold. I think we found, what, $30,000 worth of gold? 40000 easy. Maybe forty. That's pretty incredible. Yeah. <laughs> <I'm just kidding. laughs> Maybe like a 1000 or two. But, seriously, man, ton of fun. Had a great experience, and... I'm glad I got to do it with him for the first time. So definitely check out his videos. But with that said, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all next time. The hardest part about this adventure is to hike in and hike out with the scuba tank. Paul fell a little bit earlier. And I, I don't want to fall. <laughs> I didn't fall. I didn't Every fall. time you fall, I normally don't. <laughs> Help! <laughs> you could fall. <laughs> Medic! <laughs> Medic. <laughs>